fairy tale is getting crazy now we're gonna see Leon and yuka versus kagura and liliana it's gonna be just insane and the match after that is gonna be fairy tale versus saber tooth this is so exciting i can't wait and you don't have to wait because my reactions to the next few episodes are already live on patreon so check out the patreon the first link in the description it would have been fun if it was miliana versus toby because cat versus dog okay i mean i trust kagura she is strong and i think that she has a plan my prediction a draw after 30 minutes, it's a draw. Oh. Wow. She's not doing much. I thought she was, I don't know, gonna pull out some crazy lightning blast or energy blast. But no. It's still the same attack. Wait, what is this? Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. She's not doing a lot of damage because he really, she isn't really that strong. We saw her, she had, what was it, 365 as like a magic power? Huh? She's gonna dodge? Oh, two! Three! Wait. Oh. <laughs> Lots. <laughs> I, I, th I still think Leon's ice make magic is cooler than Grace. Oh, she, she has both of them? Wait, is, is Miliana really just gonna solo them? Ice make? Huh? Oh, cat and mouse. Come on. I want a serious fight. I want to see both of them go all out. Wait, what? My god. And this is... Oh my god, she's fast. She is so fast. She... Oh no, she did not. I thought she unsheathed her sword for a second. But just imagine how strong Kagura is when she uses her sword for real. She's a total different beast then. Oh my god. I like Kagura so much. I feel like she has a whole backstory that's gonna be so interesting. And Kagura is also so impressive. I didn't think that she was going to be strong at first, but I feel like she's around the same level as Erza. Oh. Okay. Mm, she's pretty fast. And she has gravity power, so... However... Oh, oh, oh my god. Gravity. She is crazy strong. It's so cool just seeing Leon fight. I really like it because we haven't seen him in a long, long time. Before this tournament, that is. Look at the visuals. Looks great. Oh my... Come on, Leon, do something! No! I was right, it's, it's a draw. Wow, Leon would have lost this battle. Nuts is gonna fight. I want to see all the anger into his punches. I want to see him just absolutely destroy Sting and Rogue. Even though I don't know. I don't know if Natsu's going to win. Because Sting and Rogue are so strong. They really are. The, di the dynamic they have with each other really feels the same as Sting and Natsu have. Sting and Rogue have. Four Dragon Slayers. Two first generation and two... Third generation. We've all been waiting for this moment. I feel like everyone has been waiting. Oh, the dragon flashback? Why is Logia? I did not expect that. This? I did not expect to see more dragons. Whoa. So was that a flashback or is that happening right now i feel like it's happening right now 30 minutes to let the match begin oh. <laughs> let's go let's go fairy tale they did not waste any time oh my god
Rogue. Oh my god, he has... Yeah, he has he's a Shadow Dragon Slayer. Wow. I'm so excited for this. Oh my god, Fairy Tail is winning. Of course, it's the beginning. Oh my fucking... It's happening. White drive. Wait, what the fuck is happening? Shadow. What is drive? What is this? What kind of. What is this form? White drive, shadow drive. What is this? Oh my god, that looks really cool though. Do you want one week early, full, uncut anime reaction videos? Then check out my brand new Patreon. That's patreon.com slash sorokingreacts or click the link in the description. Let's now continue the video. Is is the the white drive and shadow drive is that like similar to Dragon Force, the ability that Natsu has the, that he gets the, the dragon skills? It does look cool. But does it mean that Natsu's gonna learn this drive mode in the future? Yeah, it's an ability that only the third generation dragon slayers can use because because they're third generation dragon slayers and they mix like dragon force from the first generation with something from the second generation and this is what they create they're strong wait oh that's cool oh he looks like a demon oh that's how it works oh wait what Yo, they are ridiculous. <laughs> Work together. Oh, but they're also not. This is. Natsu is also not on his strongest at this point. I hope he can activate Dragon Force again. Whoa. How did these two guys kill their dragons? Was Akinologia just so much stronger than all the other dragons? Because so far, these guys have not lived up to the hype. Oh my god. Holy Nova. Natsu's not moving. So this is a special dragon slayer technique. But Natsu was not moving. <laughs> yes. Yes, he he's not moving. Did you straight up catch? No, come on. That's that's so disrespectful. That's so disrespectful. He straight up catched it. He straight up just, he catched his special attack. He just he just catched his punch. His whole special power up move. <laughs> just how strong is Natsu now? Alter, you made Natsu too strong. How is he? How is anyone going to challenge him? Oh my god! I had such high hopes for it, this battle, but it seems like Natsu and Kajil are just too strong now. Come on, Sting, Rocket, back up! I don't want this fight to be over! Come on, get back up, go into your ultimate forms! Don't make- I don't want the match to be over! I had such high hopes for this battle, and it's kind of disappointing! The prom- and what was the promise? To never- Defeat, be defeated again? Oh. Oh, this is full power. Okay, now they're at full power. Oh my god, what is this? They're becoming dragons. This really is their final form. Damn. They are incredible. This is disrespectful. Now, now Sting is gonna disrespect them. What if Natsu and Gajel just defeat Sting pretty easily, even though he has he has Dragon Force? Does Luxus have Dragon Force? Can he activate it at will? Why Dragon? Oh, oh my God! If someone should protect all the people who are just watching this tournament, because I feel like they're also in danger. And how long has the match been going on for? Because after 30 minutes, it's over. Oh! But does this do damage?
I love that the whole background, the whole fighting area has changed now. Oh no. He's Kamehameha. Oh my god, Sting is so powerful. I mean, I don't see how Natsu and Gajel can win this at this point because this is only Sting and Sting is absolutely destroying them. And I feel like Rogue is stronger than Sting. But it is nice to know that Natsu's base form is stronger than Sting's base form. More backstory, come on. But what is this promise? The promise is to never lose again. But why? Sting defeated the dragon when he was this young. He, There's no way he's strong enough to defeat the dragon on him. The solo a dragon at, when he's so small. Oh, it's... Iridia is just defeating Natsu, it's not never losing, it's promise to defeat Natsu and prove that Lector was right. And did Rogue make the same promise? Oh my god, damn. Wow. Did Rogue make the same promise but with Gajel? I don't think so. Otherwise he would have wanted to fight as well. It's actually over. It's over, wow. I did not think it would be over. I thought they were gonna get back up. Aww. Oh. They're back up. I got chills, I got chills. <laughs> now the real fight starts. So you get better get back into your dragon forest mode because otherwise you're gonna lose. Oh my god. Natsu is so much stronger than I thought. Oh my god, no. no. What are they doing? <laughs> oh no! He has motion sickness, of course. What is this? What the fuck is this? What is this fire? No, the episode's over! No, no, no! Oh no, the episode is over! <laughs> oh, the episode is over already. Oh, I'm so excited to watch the next episode. I think it's really funny that Natsu just <laughs> sent Gajel away in a minecart and Gajel has motion sickness so he can't really get out of there. He's basically just stuck. <laughs> And who knows where he ends up. I feel like Gajel is gonna end up somewhere with the Raven Tail or maybe even somewhere where the Eclipse Project is. But at this point, I really don't care about Gajel. I want to see the fight. Can not really solo Sting and Rogue. In the beginning, they looked pretty weak. I thought they were gonna be a lot stronger than they are. But then they pulled out the Dragon Force and that looked serious. They looked powerful in this form. But then Natsu and Gajel just got back up. Like, like nothing happened. The three months of training and the second origin unlocking has leveled Natsu and Gajel up so much. Currently, they are on a completely different level than they were before. Um, and really quickly, I want to talk about the Leon versus Kagura fight. Uh, yes, y Yuka and Milania were also there. Both of them were not really that impressive. I really didn't have any high hopes for Yuka. Because even in the beginning of the story, he was pretty weak. And Milania is just pretty dumb. <laughs> yeah, um, she's not really that impressive. She's not strong. So it was basically just Kagura versus Leon. It sucks that we didn't get to see them go all out in a battle. And that they reached the time limit. Because I think Kagura would have won. But I would have loved seeing how strong Leon has gotten. I feel like the next episode is going to be... Natsu versus Sting and Rogue. Natsu is probably gonna win, I assume, because he sent Gajel away and he seemed pretty confident. So I'm so excited for the next episode. Really hope you enjoyed this video. Check out the Patreon link in the description. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.